<laughs> Imagine finding out you're allergic to a fruit while you're vlogging, while you're shooting a fruit reaction video. That's hilarious. <laughs> back to my youtube channel if you're new you're welcome kindly subscribe to my channel and if you're returning you're also welcome so guys today actually not today but i've had it in mind to try some filipino local fruits like indigenous fruits you get i've had it in mind for a while but it's been hard for me to get to get those fruits and actually i wrote down some some fruit let me read it out i wrote down a teas that's the sugar apple i wrote down santol cutting fruit i wrote down um rambutan mangosteen and guyabano last weekend i went to carbon market to look for this fruit but i don't know if it's because it was raining or they actually don't have the fruit there but one of the lady i asked i asked her for this particular fruit i asked her, okay where can i get this fruit but she was like they're out of season but guess what i passed through kasambangan fruit stand that's just on vanilla road and guess what i saw some of this fruit some of the fruit i want to try and that's where i'm headed now i'm heading to that fruit stand to get these fruits hopefully i'll get everything but if they're not if i don't get everything i'm just going to get the ones that are available and yeah i'm going to try them and you guys are going to watch it you're going to see it and i'll be reacting to all the fruits i tried today trust me you don't want to miss this so stay tuned i'll be right back don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel and leave a comment okay all right hi guys i just got here so she's helping me out with the fruits this one guava right oh, this guava. yeah guava mango stain what's the name of this one Atis. Atis. yeah yeah i want this one too and i can see some of the fruits i want i don't know if this is on my list sugar apple Atis. yeah this one mm. So I'm just asking her how much is this per kilo? How much? 100 per kilo? Okay, what of this one? Fila per kilo? 300. 300. Okay, I'll just check there. I'm coming. I'll get this one. So they don't have. Hi, Kira. They don't have Rambuntan. I'm trying to check for Rambuntan. Name? Name? Sinagolas. Hmm? Sinagolas. Sinagolas? Yes. Spanish clam. Spanish? Oh. Is it clean? Can I? Oh, yeah. What about rambutan? We don't have rambutan. Out of season? Yeah. Oh. What's the name of this one? Melon. Melon? What of Santol? No Santol. Out of season also? Out of season also? Yeah. Wow. A lot of things are out of season. What name, 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 name. Pumelo. Pumelo. Should I try this too? Is it ripe? Ripe? Okay, give me one. So I'll get one of these. This was not on my list, but I'm going to get it. Since I can't see most of the other fruits I want to try. Hi guys. So I'm back with my fruits. Oh, let me see. Okay. Ah. Uh, I'll just attach a video of it. So actually, I planned on buying five fruits, but when, but when I got there, most of the fruits I had in mind, such as santol, um, rambutan, they were not available. Um, the sellers told me that rambutan and santol they're out of season but i got these ones i'll be trying them this is pomelo i'm actually trying this for the first time looks like orange 
I'm not sure if it tastes the same way, but this is pomelo. I've tried the flavor before. I've tried the flavor, pomelo flavor of a drink, but I have never tried the f actual fruit. So this is my first time. And artist. This is my first time trying it, but I've been looking forward to it. I was skeptical about buying it today because they said I have to leave it for two to three days. But then I asked the seller, how do I know when it's ripe? And he said, if I press it and it's soft, it means it's ripe. So I've been pressing this and it's really, really ripe, as you can see. It's really soft and I think it's ripe. So I'll be trying this too. And then I have this mango stain. Mango stain. Yeah, I think I've tried this one before. I think I've tried it before, but I'm not sure. So I'll be trying it again, anyways. And this is when I was looking for what to buy. The seller asked me to try this. I'll be letting you guys know my honest, honest, let's say honest, honest opinion about this fruit. So these are the four fruits I have on my plate. I was actually going to buy five today, but most of the other fruits I saw. I know them i've tried them before so yeah we'll be trying just this so the first fruit i want to try is the artist like really i've had this one in mind for the longest time i've been seeing it and i'm like i really want to try this it doesn't even look like apple but it's called artist here in the philippines so are you ready i'm ready i don't know how i'm supposed to take this but i believe i'm just supposed to This is very nice. The inside is so soft. Okay. This is really, really, really nice. The inside is so milky. And it has a lot of seeds inside. And it's so milky. Like, I'm going to rate this a 9 out of 10. Nine. I'm giving it a 9. I should give it a 10, but I have hopes for the others, so I'm just going to give it a 9. Hmm. Okay, I'll take a pause on this one so I can try the rest. Pumelo. I don't know how to take this. I actually just divided it into four parts and then I took two parts and I don't know how I'm supposed to take this but I'm hoping this is the right way. Or do I just... Hmm. Okay, I think it's actually better if I do it this way. so this is really like orange but the back the outer part is thicker than a usual orange and as i'm taking this i'm having this weird feeling on my lips and it's as if they are getting pink or lighter than they were i hope i'm not allergic to this fruit <laughs> imagine finding out you're allergic to a fruit while you're vlogging while you're shooting a fruit reaction video that's hilarious but I'm having this sensation here if you don't usually have that while you're taking this fruit please let me know because I'm freaking out <laughs> I'm freaking out anyways I love this fruit can you see how the inside looks very similar to orange but still very different from orange yeah so I'm just going to take a pause on this one as well. Hmm. Hmm. So I'm going to rate this a 7 out of 10. Remember, the artist got 9 over 10. 
and the pomelo got a 7 out of 10. Are we ready for the next? And the next food, guys, is mango stain. <laughs> Are you ready? This is another food I don't know how to take. Well, um, we are going to go as my instincts direct. Wow. Just look at that. <laughs> oh. Can you see? And then, boom. <laughs> oh, this is giving me artist vibe as well. Slaps. Mm. Wow. This is quite similar to Artis, like the inside. Uh, it has a lot of seeds. But this one slaps. This one is just sweet and milky, but this one, it slaps. <laughs> so, but it nice. It slaps. It's sour, but I love it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's sweet but then it's uh wow mm. this is the inside of it so what i just finished taking was all in here enclosed by the other parts it's got no good <laughs> it's got no good <laughs> somebody said only god makes the outer part of a fruit hard and how it makes liquid to the inside that fruit is just amazing it's beyond human understanding guess what fruit i'm talking about i'm talking about coconuts i'm talking about coconuts and coconut is a very very common fruit here in the philippines they have a lot of coconut trees you can find coconut anywhere and one thing i like that filipinos make with coconut is actually buko buko is it buko panda i don't know but buko drink i think buko stands for coconut my god it's milky and when it's fresh mm, it's so nice it's so so sweet when it's fresh and then it's blended it's really nice you guys should try buko if you haven't try it try buko drink it's really nice really really nice you'll love it it's milky and so sweet okay okay back to my fruit <laughs> maybe one of these days i should try making buko drink yeah i think i should try it I'll think about it but it's time to rate mangosteen if i'm to rate mangosteen i'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. it's everything in one 10 out of 10. my new favorite all right guys now moving to the last fruit i have on my plate this is kalamata olive kalamata olive mm. Mm. ouch mm. ah no i don't like this one i really do not like it It smells like a plant I know back home in Nigeria. <laughs> I don't like this one. I do not like Kalabata olives. 
okay i'll just give it a fast rating it's a four it's a four for me a four out of ten so my top five this is oh this is not top this is not number one mango steam is number one artist is number two pomelo pomelo is number three and this is the last one number four so you have it guys i enjoyed most part of this video but towards the end it was no fun it was no fun for me i'm actually looking forward to trying santol um santol rambutan and the rest of the fruit i wasn't able to get today i'm looking forward to trying them so just expect a part two of this video because this is only part one this is only the beginning anticipate part two <laughs> i'm very dramatic this night i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you did i enjoyed trying out this fruit now whenever i go to a fruit stand i can pick out other fruits other than my usual i can take artist i can take mangosteen i can take pomelo and the rest of the fruits i'm here to try how many of these fruits have you tried and can you relate to any feeling or rating i gave to these fruits <laughs> let me know in the comment section and do you guys want to see a part two do you want a part two of my local fruit reaction let me know in the comment section okay so thank you guys so much for staying tuned to my video if you stay till this very part of it you're the real OGs. <laughs> all right you know the drill like this video comment subscribe if you have one like it's not fair when you come on my channel you enjoy my video and you leave without subscribing it breaks my heart it really really does break my heart so please click the subscribe button okay and leave a comment for me it goes a long way leave a comment leave a comment leave a comment to turn this video at exactly 12 36 a.m peace out